Hey guys, Cloudstalker here. The Love is in the Air event has just gone live today and so I thought I'd make a video on how you can make gold in this event but also how you can farm the lovely charm bracelets needed to get all the other toys or cosmetics of your choosing. So this event consists mostly of dailies that grant you 5 love tokens each. In total there are 6 dailies for each character. You have one sort of daily in each capital of your faction, so if you're Horde, one in Orgrimmar, Thunderbluff, another one in Silvermoon, and the last one in Undercity. These four dailies required you to give a lovely charm bracelet to a prominent figure within the capital. Now out of the other two dailies left, one is extremely simple having you to throw chocolate to around 10 random players or NPCs, and the other one is a lot more complicated and a lot involves you going to Silverpine Forest. And now an added bonus is the daily chance to do the event special dungeon that gives you a chance at getting the pink rocket uh, mount which is pretty rare. This also gives you around 5 to 8 love tokens so combining all these you should be able to make 35 tokens each day. So the event lasts for around 14 days that makes a total of 490 tokens as a whole with one character. Now, this requires you to have about at least 4 lovely charm bracelets each day. To have these to drop, you need to have the lovely charm collector's kit that you automatically get if you take any of the dailies from the event or you can also, also simply ask for one. Now you require mobs that give XP or are max level for the lovely charms to drop. To farm these in Shadowlands, uh, you need a very high spawn rate area. The area that I personally used was in Revendreth, around about here. This is a famous BOE farm that you can tag along with people or do it solo. Now doing it solo I got 4 charms in about 15 minutes or so. It wasn't too bad. I farmed a tad extra to save up charms for my alts and for the dailies I'll be planning to do in the following days. I think you would get way more charms in a group and I suggest that you do do this in a group. Alternatively you can also simply buy the lovely charm bracelets off of people in the realm. In my realm they normally go between 50 to 100 gold, now there should be similar prices for you in your realm but I imagine there will be some differences, I can't say depending on, depending on the population. Uh, now there are literally people who farm these, so well, it's now I wouldn't suggest that you farm them. I would suggest that if you're farming BOE items you're gonna get these anyway so it's an added bonus. I wouldn't suggest that you separately farm these bracelets unless you really think it's gonna be worth it and they're higher in price in your realm. Uh, so now to the money making part. You get about 270 tokens and then you can buy the mount. The mount it goes for around 130,000 gold. But this price will drop and this will normally sell around 50 to 60,000 gold. Now in my own personal experience this normally always sells at around 50 to 60. It's very rare for this to sell higher. Now this is because a lot of people already have this mount and the people who usually get it are collectors and so they wait for the price to drop. And I've tried selling it throughout the year and I only ended up selling one for 61,000 personally. So I suggest that you do this on multiple alts to get the most gold out of it. Otherwise you're not looking at a lot. Now with the extra tokens, if you fancy, you can get the toys which are pretty cool and not to forget that they're rare, so I, I personally love the toys. Now that's all there is to this event, I hope you liked this video and do subscribe for more content to help me grow the channel. Thank you and take care.